Hey everyone. Well, with everyone talking about the infamous 11-11-11 date, I did a couple of uh, searches, and to my amazement, there are a lot of people with a lot of theories, and I just thought I'd give you my views on what I think about this whole 11-11 thing. Now, I don't know about the actual date of 11-11-11 that's coming up in three days or so, but I can tell you that I had my own experiences with the number 11-11. Now, uh, I had way too many experiences to go into any great detail, but I can tell you a couple of stories that happened to me. Uh, other than seeing the 11-11 on clocks, more often to be coincidence, I also see it in, uh, I've also seen it on uh, really inanimate objects, such as uh, phones. I can give you one uh, story that really was uh, pretty shocking. Uh, after seeing the 11-11 phenomenon for about a few months, I was in at this hotel, and uh, it just so happens that that hotel room had a broken phone. You know, one of, the, one of those digital phones, and uh, the, uh, the phone wasn't working. And when I went to, uh, you know, look down at the uh, thing, to my amazement, the actual uh, clock was still working. And lo and behold, the actual time it was stuck on was 11-11. So that's only one of many stories I can tell you that happened to me throughout the years. But I've had dreams about 11-11. Uh, there are crop circles uh, on 11-11 uh, that are uh, on the Internet. Um, and I can also tell you that uh, after digging uh, a little deeper into it, I was amazed and almost fell off my chair to actually tell you that uh, while looking at the uh, December 21st, 2012 date, the actual uh, time that that happens in Greenwich Mean Time, and you guys can look this up on the internet, is exactly 11.11 Greenwich Mean Time, or uh, not Greenwich Mean Time, uh, you know, uh, yeah, I think it's Greenwich Mean Time, GMT. So you guys can take a look at that, see I'm not lying. Uh, that's the actual date that the Mayans uh, say that uh, we line up with the, uh, what is it, that celestial plane? That's at 11.11 Greenwich Mean Time. So that's another, uh, either you can call it a coincidence, or you can call it whatever. But uh, I, I also looked into a couple of uh, books into it when I started uh, thinking I was going crazy. And I was also amazed to see that a lot of people wrote books on it. Uh, I think uh, Solara uh, has a book out, is 1111, and it's a very spiritual book, and it tries to explain that when you see 1111, it's not a bad thing or an ominous thing. But it's an actual uh, sign that, you know, you're awake and you're aware of the things around you more, more than other people are. It seems that a lot of people that don't see 11-11 are uh, those people that are kind of like asleep. And I don't mean asleep, literally asleep. I mean, you know, spiritually asleep. Those people that tend to, you know, just be in a dreamland pretty much, you know. Uh, you know, those are the people that actually... I'm more tending to uh, read Star Magazine and watch Dancing with the Stars and be worried about all that other nonsense that's on TV other than being aware of your surroundings and being aware of what's actually happening on this planet. So um, that's what I found anyway. Now, uh, this 11, 11, 11, it seems that uh, there's a DVD out actually. It says Timothy Gibbs and Michael Lanz. I don't know what that's about it, but... It says about mark the date, you can't stop what's coming. So I'm not exactly sure what they say is coming, but I can tell you that I've had my own experiences with the number 11 uh, on clocks, on books. I've even had a book, believe it or not, I had a book that fell, and uh, the chapter was 11. It always lands on 11. I mean, I've had the number 11 comes up so often that I thought I was actually going crazy at one point. And the only thing that actually saved me from, you know, thinking I was going nuts was I looked into it on the Internet, and sure enough, when I saw people writing books on it and talking about it in forums and actually uh, seeing a date of the Mayan calendar, and it comes up 11-11, uh, Greenwich Mean Time, you know, I, it's a something to this, guys. Now, whether or not this is going to be an ominous date of the destruction of the world on 11-11-11, I don't think so. I think it's something that we have to be aware of. I do think something's going to happen. What, I do not know. But it should be interesting, guys. Take it easy. Be well. Bye.